Okay, I don't know what I'll do. Hey everybody, I'm Anubis from Anubis Let's Plays and Monster Farm CNC Productions, and you're probably wondering, hey, 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 those two Ludicolas were paralyzed in the last video, and they were full health. Yeah, officially, I suck. I lost to the Mexican, I'm not gonna deny it. I'm a disappointment here. Yeah, um, pretty much I had his Sword of Widow as the last Pokemon. Oh, crap, I just spoiled it. Oh, okay, there you go, Sword of Widow is his last Pokemon if you're wondering. Um, yeah, I was up to his last Pokemon and oh, it owned me because it uses Rock Slide and it hits both of your Pokemon and wow, it is just irritating to the max. Um, See, so yeah, I'm reversing him again, but this time we will defeat him. I will not lose twice to a Mexican because that is not like me. Yeah, she's not like me. Um, okay, so this Ludicolio, Ludicolio, <laughs> this Ludicolo is going down. I'm going to single target each of them because that's just the way I roll. Okay, come on, crocodile. Oh, damn it! Oh, come on! Oh my god! Uh, the water is actually, well, the rain's actually beneficial for um. Croconaw, to be honest, just actually, I oh know, I'm gonna attack you and then you're gonna attack him. Good. Um, yeah, the rain's actually beneficial for Croconaw, except that they're both grass water, so of course, Surf wouldn't do much, even if it was boosted. Uh, as long as he astonishes, isn't it Flappy? Okay, please don't be flinched. Okay. Wow, did a fair chunk of damage. Okay, Flappy, knock his block off. Mexican one is down for the count. Bow and wow. Okay. Ah, Mirror B sent out Ludicolo. This is third Mexican. And I really gotta start with these Mexican jokes. Anyhow, um, now I'm going to take care of the one which I've already damaged. If he stops astonished spamming. But then again, I'm Shadow Rush spamming. Um, sweet. Good. Um, yeah, the whole move set or scenario of what he does is when it's not raining, both of them use rain dance. When it is, one of the bloody Ludicolos uses Leech Seed on one of your Pokemon and the other one, um, and they just spam Astonish and Leech Seed and make Mega Drain and all that. So once it stops raining, that is your chance to go full out hardcore on the. Um, Pokemon and nuke it in that one turn, if you can. Uh, Croconaw, you can take him out, and Flaffy, go for Ludicolo, the one that's full of health. Or should I label him Ludicolo number three? You're down, number two's down. Here comes number four. This is gonna be irritating to the max. Shadow Rush. Bada boom. Wasn't a critical. Wow. Well, that's a change. The rain stopped. Fantastic. Okay, now's our chance. I'm actually going to attack. Uh, attack. <laughs> attack the other Ludicolo as it is lower leveled, I guess. And. I don't know, it hasn't put Leech Seed on. Yeah, there you go, it hasn't put Leech Seed on. Okay, come on, Flappy. It's your time to shine. So they're gonna waste their turns on Rain Dance. Yep, you failed. Okay, come on, critical hit. Straight to the face. Okay, good. I was hoping you'd make it faint, but you know, when it's not the. Chooses, even though I'm a loser here, but huh. okay, this isn't good. That one's gonna be a bit of a pain, that Ludicolo there. Our uh, Croconaw should be able to take one of them out. Still in hyper mode. Um, I'm gonna risk it. I know it's oh, sweet, Croconaw's got that one, but Flappy's probably gonna um, faint anyway, and it's probably gonna go into hyper mode effect and attack randomly with Shadow Rush. 
Here's the last Pokemon, like I said, suitable to level 35, female. And the reason I'm saying it's because it's a Shadow Pokemon. Yes, a sort of would can be caught. Hit underwater, damn it. Shadow Rush, wasted, damn it, damn it, damn it. Crocodile's out. Wow, wow. Okay, yeah, oh, flap these too. What a shame. Hey, if you're actually wanting to go into competitions or battles and stuff, that's a pretty good combination. I'm not saying having a full team of Ludicolos is good, but, you know, um, actually we'll send that skip loom. Um, yeah, doing that combination of Leech Seed, if it's double battles, of course, Leech Seed on both of the Pokemon, and um, if it's got Rain Dish or Swift Swim, having that up is also holding leftovers is very good, or um, some sort of item that can, you know, benefit from that. I'm not sure if there's an item, I can't quite remember if there's an item where, um, where you actually, oh, I'm trying to think of the word. Oh, Mantine's faster. Oh, yeah, it's got Swift Swim. Oh, God, I'm going to do it. Um, come on, Cameron, think. Um, yeah, I'm not sure if it's an item where it's raining and you can actually be healed. I'm pretty sure there is one. I'm not, I'm not too certain, but if there is, that'd be good to have as well. Um, recently, actually, on Pokemon Black and White, I went online for the first time and I versed some of the trainers. I versed this person in Japan or China, I'm pretty sure Japan though, and my god, I, it seemed like a stupid idea, but wow, she had a, um, she or he, either either, you never know, um, but it was a she, so the trainer was female. Um, she had a, um, Glizcor, or Glizor, whatever you want to call it, and, um, that Pokemon had, oh, I've got the ability, it's something like Poison Heal, and it had a Poison Orb, and it was Poison, and each turn it would be healed instead of damaged from the Poison, and I was like, oh, okay, well, it's not too bad, you should do too much, right? Wrong! It was the biggest pain in the ass, oh, wow, lucky! Anyhow, it was the biggest pain in the ass I'd ever versed, because it would think it used Substitute, and then it would heal itself each turn, and yeah, I don't know, I think it, the Pokemon before that, I can't remember who it was, used um, Stealth Rocks, or it used Spikes or something like that, and in the end it was just a repetitive battle, it went for a long while, and in the end I just had to switch because I had like Bravery or something, and I don't know, just in the end it turned out that she kept gaining more and more health and I kept losing more and more and in the end I just gave up because it was a pretty smart tactic. I can't remember it exactly, but yeah, um, this was an ability or something called Poison Heal, and when it's poison it gets healed. So, um, that's pretty smart. And there's another combo for you as well. Uh, the move Facade, uh, when you're poison paralyzed or burnt, you deal more damage. So there you go. Have a Pokemon with Poison, heal, um, have a Toxic Orb, and then use Facade, and you'll be dealing a load of damage while healing yourself each turn. Okay, this is over, come on. Let's defeat this Mexican once and for all. Okay, Mantine's pretty angry about this as well. Come on, confused? Oh, not good. Okay, I should be able to Shadow Rush with Mantine anyway, and um, if it is confused, then it will knock the color out, unless a critical hit from Shadow Rush does. Or it might not, you never know. Uh, this one has range-ish, doesn't it? I'm not sure. Yes, it does. Okay, so speed is not an issue for either of them. Come on, Shadow Rush, knock them out. Okay, go. Bada boom. Okay, Skip Limb should take this out. Wait, what? I didn't even call it. Okay, oddball. It still took it out, that's the main thing. There you go, sometimes in hyper mode the Pokemon can come to its senses and you don't even need to call it. Unless I did call it, I don't think I did. Anyhow, finally the freak of a nature's gone. Sefer Abin Mirror B defeated. I can't keep up with the tempo. Oh no, no, what's a no, no? What? Wow. Phew. How, 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 how dare you? Don't you dare think you'll get away with your latest outrage. One of these days, I will take great pleasure in kicking you about with my elegant dance steps. Oh, and I'm not giving up our Shadow Pokemon plan. Let's go. Escape! Run away! Yeah. 
and little colors or his Mexican minions follow behind him. Kion Kion. Anubis, did you hear those cries? It must be Plusle. I think his cries came from behind that door. Sure did. But hold on. What is this? What is this? Bum, 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 bum. We found TM49. But what could it be? What could it be? What could it? Oh, it's Snatch. Well, that's a waste. <laughs> nah, it's alright. Snatch is a move where, for example, if you're going to use something like Reflect or that, you'd steal the move off of them. And yeah, it's pretty helpful. But anyhow, here we have a Macho Brace. Useful if you're wanting to use Poker Ross and EV Train, but not really useful here. Yeah, I don't really use them. I only use them if I'm EV Training. But here's another Ean File. Ean File P. And there it is. Kyun Kyun. Kyun Kyun Kyun. Anubis, Blossel! <laughs> Just ignore Navi, yep. <laughs> gasp, gasp. Anubis, you're safe. Oh, and Blossel. Kyung, 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 kyung. Kyung, 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 kyung. Mirror B got away, but things will be back to normal there. Dookin. I don't know what to say. Forget it, Silver. For all unharmed, that's good enough. Even that Mirror B's being driven out thanks to Anubis. Kyung, kyung, kyung. <laughs> hmm, what's that, Puzzle? Feeling hungry out of relief? Wahaha! <laughs> okay, Anubis, let's quit this moldy cabin and quick. Teleport! Anubis, you do a great deal. Sincerely, thank you. If you were even a bit late, Puzzle could have been made a Shadow Pokemon. That's horrible. I'm glad everything's fine, Papa, and Puzzle too. Kyun, 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 kyun. Hmm, what's that, Puzzle? Oh, you want to? Okay. I understand. Anubis, could you take my Plusle with you? Plusle's saying it wants to help you too. Kyung, 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 kyung. How many kyuns do you have to say, God damn it? <laughs> yes, yes, that's right. You can't let those criminals get away with it. That's amazing. We've got a cute and brave addition to our party. Anubis, I'm counting on you. And it waddles over to us. And jumps into our pants. <laughs> ah, Plusle jumps into our pants. Anubis, wait, no. <laughs> What am I going on about? Plus, it was transferred to the PC. Oh my god. I intend to investigate the organization behind Mirror B. It's Organization 13! No, I'm joking. As soon as I discover anything, I will be in touch. Which reminds me, Anubis, I need your P Star DA number. Anubis gave Dukin the P Star DA number. Perfect. I'll be in touch as soon as we discover anything. Yes! We are finished with Pyrite Town! Well,. You guys are, I'm not. I've still got to do the Colosseum. But, yeah, we're done. Let's talk to him. Deep in his town is another town that goes by the name The Under. Mirabee's mob may have been smuggling Shadow Pokemon in from there. I'm going to do a little digging in the underground town of The Under. Okay, cool. Big people, please be nice to Puzzle. Okay. So, we've finished Pyrite Town. Oh my god. I'm gonna do the Colosseum, you know. Oh, look who's there. Yeah, I'm gonna do the Colosseum um, off screen and I'll show you what I got, but. Oh my god, it's a witch! 15. Ah, I might be imagining it, but the town's dirty air feels. <laughs> the town's air feels somewhat less dirty. But not all as well. I can feel the presence of black auras coming from Shadow Pokemon. Wow, 15, nothing escapes your notice. Derp. <laughs> There has been nothing that eludes to notice my fortune telling. Four, 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 four. <laughs> Some of the laughs are stupid. The key to freeing Pokemon from that black aura is in the north. Up north, that's where my grandpa lives too. Oh my gosh, you had an epiphany. Oh no, I forgot. I was on my way to visit grandpa. He lives in a gate village. That's north of here. Four, four, four. That being north may be no mere coincidence. Your answer may be there. Oh, my grandpa was a famous trainer when he was young. Maybe my grandpa could know something. Let's go see him, Anubis. Yes. I was telling you about a gate village, perhaps, in one of my parts. But that is where we get to purify Pokemon. Spoilers! Um, yeah. So, joy or joy. Croconaw, you'll be free. You'll be free. Who cares about you? Don't care about you. Don't care about you. And don't care about you. But yes, uh, we're already up to 14 minutes and 35 seconds. So I'm going to run over to the Colosseum and I'll probably do those three matches then um, when I'm doing my next part. So yes, finally we've finished Pyrite Town, the Pyrite Cave for now. Dun dun dun. And um, yes, I will see you on the next part of Let's Play Pokemon Colosseum. I'm Anubis from Anubis Let's Plays and also from TNT Productions. Have a fantastic day and see you next time.